Our Pledge of Allegiance will be led by the three little girls that are right there that should be up here. Third grade. To the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. At that time, he noted how poppies quickly grew around the graves of those who died in battle. According to legend, fellow soldiers retrieved the poem after the prey. <coughs> To you from failing hands we throw. The torch be yours to hold it high. If you break. For the Marine Corps, retired Marine Corps Gunnery Sergeant Alan Hoyle. For the Navy, retired Lieutenant Commander Larry Klein. For the Air Force, Former Captain Kathy Lachlan. Yes, friends, family, and especially Chris. I want to thank Chris because he's the one that is responsible for me being here today. And we don't dress up often, but when we do, we do it for the right occasions, and this is the right place and the right occasion to send a tribute to those that have gone before us free. But the American Legion and the disabled American veterans also want to recognize that there are ones that still serve the community here. Still keeping a cool head in tight situations, eager to learn and has become an excellent road deputy. He's always willing to do more than his share of work. His consistentness and passion for education has not only benefited his colleagues, but has made him an invaluable asset to the Denver Fire Department and he epitomizes all the qualities held dear to the fire service. And professional with both the public and her colleagues and sets a great example of the service that the public expects from the Lincoln Police Department. She is a dependable, hard worker and leads the department in felony drug arrests. These people were nominated by their superiors, so they, they are being recognized by the ones that they answer to and, and showing their professionalism and what they Last year we began honoring an auxiliary member of the year, and this year the auxiliary member of the year is very special. I think without her, Chris would be lost, and we know Chris does a lot, but I think really the needs I may do
give him a hand and recognize recognize the law for they've had to endure. Before the end of the ceremony, one of our auxiliary members are going to catch up to, with you. Uh, we're going to get a, a phone number or an address, and we have something for you from the American Legion. Thank you very much.